have cancer. Tell your doctor right away. Wash gloves or put color in your urine or paint while you urinate. Oh, it's recording. Oh my gosh, didn't I know? Okay, what's up, YouTubers? This is the one and only Andrea. Um, I know I have not been on here in a very, 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 very long time. I do apologize for that. I have a lot of people that's been inboxing me, asking me to come back on YouTube to, you know, share my journey with my weight loss. So for those who have not um, watched my videos in the past. I am Andrea. Um, I had um, gastric sleeve surgery on June the 1st of 2015. I'm trying to make a video. I don't need y'all up here bothering me. Um, my starting weight was 340 pounds. Um, I am about 5'3". I was wearing a size 20... 628 in tops in the size 24 in bottoms um i was big y'all just umpa loompa big um i started my journey in october of 2014 so i had medicaid and medicaid um i made you do six months of six months of like a wellness checks up healthy checkup something like that and I had to do that in Columbia well no I actually started in Kansas with mines and then I came to find out that Kansas was no longer offering the gastric sleeve surgery so I didn't want to have the bypass so nothing against the bypass that's just nothing that I wanted to do um so I decided to have the sleeve so then I went over to Missouri in Columbia Missouri with Dr. Sullivan um, he performed my surgery. Awesome surgeon. Surgeon, sorry. Um, so I'm just very excited about my results, um, about my lifestyle change. Um, so I have lost a total of 130 pounds in eight months, a little over eight months, eight and a half months. Um, I currently weigh 209. Hey, everybody, 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 hey, everybody, everybody. So I like lost 131. Who's counting? So I'm like 10 pounds away from being in the Wonderland. Um, um, oh. Sorry, I was watching the show on TV. Um, I'm currently wearing an extra large in tops. And a 14 in bottom. I'm so excited. Uh, I'm on my cell phone trying to videotape because I didn't want to get my laptop. Um, so this is the excess skin. It's not that bad. But I don't exercise, so maybe if I exercise, it will look better. It's not that bad. Um, the part that I don't really like is this. I'm not trying to expose myself, but the loose skin on my breast, you guys, is horrific. I have a small neck now. My legs are small. My stomach still looks the same. Um, I'm able to run. I like run every day. Like, I have a five-year-old son named Micah, and when we go to his school, me and him race to the door, and then after I drop him off in school and sign him in, then I run back to the car. So I do that all the time like throughout the day I'm running and I noticed that it's helping my thighs tighten up so if I start doing stuff like this I, I'm making a video oh okay she want me to blow her nose tell everybody hi hi tell me your name Kitty. this is my youngest my three year old hey. her name is Mackenzie you love mommy tell everybody you love me I love you, Mommy. How much you love me? Yes. You love me together? Yes. Um, give me some kisses. Alright, go put this in the trash and go to bed, baby. Um, let's get on about my eating habits. Okay, so, at first, after I had surgery, I'm just going to be very honest and blunt about everything. I'm not going to hold anything back. 
I don't have much time because I don't think it's going to allow me to record a lot. But I'm going to try to get as much as I got to get in. If I got to do part two, I'll do part two. All right, so my eating habits. After I had surgery, I was like on it. I was hitting that protein, my fluids. I was doing it like for real, y'all. I was taking my medicine like for real, y'all. I'm eight and a half months out. Did it text you? Nope. I try my hardest to get my protein in. Half the time, I don't even have an appetite to eat, to be honest with you. I have to remind myself to eat because I'm almost about to pass out. Which is not healthy or safe at all. Thank you. Um, I drink about four bottles of water a day, which is a 16-ounce bottle. So I'm getting about eight bottles of water in, which is cool because it's eight ounces or whatever. That's great. Um... I kind of eat what I want to eat just in moderations now. If I want a piece of candy, I'm going to take a bite of candy. It's not like I can eat a whole bag of candy. Take a couple of bites and I'm finished. Sometimes I don't even have the desire. Sometimes I just want it, you know, when it's that time of month or whatever. Um, after my grandmother passed away in September, that's when I started eating candy again. And I don't know how to let it go again because I was doing so good. I had stopped eating candy. Soda pop, chips. Look, look what I got. Like I'm I'm being like really upfront and honest. But it still hasn't slowed down my weight loss. I just don't sit up and eat the whole bag. My kids I ate uh, like maybe two donuts out the whole maybe three donuts out the whole bag. That was like one a day. And then my kids finished the rest of them. I can't eat a lot. Um my hair oh my gosh this is the part that freaks me out the most although my hair is growing it's like long it's long granted but my hair my never been this thin it is so thin like It's extremely thin. So sorry watching this television show but yeah my hair has been shedding like crazy so i've been trying to up my bio 10 taking a thousand i mean ten thousand milligrams of bio 10 now so it's still growing it out but it's not filling it up so i just bought some jamaican oil and some shea butter to mix it up to create my own little concoction of something to get some more thickness to my hair um my skin is clear um my boobs have like disappeared i was in a size 48 a b c d e f g h i j k l i was in a 48 l now i'm in a 42 42 a b c d e f g i'm in a g now a, B, C, D, E, F, G. So I went from a 48L to a 42G in eight and a half months. Um, and depending on what bra I get, I can fit a triple D. It's weird. Like the bra I have on now, it's a triple D. And I also invested in some great girdles. They're not like the body ones that you put underneath you. They're, um, sorry, you guys, I found my earring. We're part of it. It's not the one that you put on like panties. It's just like a tank top girdle. I got these the other day and I'm telling you it works out so great for anybody who has weight loss surgery or lost weight without it. All that excess skin. It keeps it tight and right, baby. Um, Let me see what else. If you have any questions, ask. I'm an open book about this. I don't hide behind it. Um, if this is what you decide to do. I mean, you have questions and concern about the process and the journey and how you feel, da 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 da. Hit me up. Um, you can email me or find me on Facebook. 
I will try to put some stuff in the description box on YouTube. I kind of suck at doing this stuff. But if you want to find me on Facebook, it's Andrea Elias. That's my name. You'll find me. Um, if you want to send me an email, it is jaymic0511 at gmail.com. Um, I'm here to answer any questions or any concerns. I mean, I love it. Like, this changed my life for the best. I would have never thought in a million years that I would have got surgery because I'm a punk. Like, for real, y'all. I'm scared of everything. Literally. But, thank you guys for listening. I appreciate everybody that has been watching my videos. I love you guys. You guys rock. You guys are awesome. Always remember to keep Christ in the middle, the center, the front, the back of your life. Okay? Peace, love, and Christ. This just got interesting.